Hi friends, this is Manish Pandey. Welcome back. In the previous video, you saw that how to rename file and now in this video, I'm going to show you how to rename multiple files. Here I have one example where I have old file name here in this Excel file and in the second column, I have this new file name. It means in the existing file name, I'm going to include UiPath RP underscore that file name, right? So I want to rename. Now here you can see these are the files that I have in this folder and I'm going to design our project so it will rename all the files with this new file name. So how can we do that? First you can see here we have this Excel list where first we'll be taking our old file name and second will be the new file name and this will be our location. So first thing we need to read that Excel file. So we'll take read range that is part of worksheet. And here I'm going to select that Excel location. So go to download, select rename files, give the range blank. Now take here one variable name that is data table. So we have this files data table. Now take one for each row using this for each row activity will take one by one row data right here files and here we need to take here invoke code I'm going to use this invoke code click on edit code and this is vb.net code right here file io dot file system dot rename file open close bracket we need file as a string and new name file as a string means it will take complete path and new name just a file name so here let me now show you currently from this excel we are just getting our file name now we need our old file name as a complete path and then file name so let me take this complete path here let me take this copy and take here one assign activity in the for each loop take here old file name control k old file full path like that and right here in the value the complete path and then we need that file name that is coming from excel so right here plus and then row of that column name so our column name is old file name dot to a string so by this way we are making a full file path I sign full path now click on edit arguments and create two arguments here one for old file name second for new file name and then here in the old file name we have that variable old file full path and in the new file name we are going to pass our row of column name new file name then dot to string now click OK. Now click on edit code and pass here that argument that we have we passed here in the input arguments. Right here old file name comma new file name. Now click OK. And now we are ready to run this. So what will happen once we'll run that it will first read this Excel file. It will take both column data and then it will rename these files with the data available in the new file name column okay and now click on run file and you see here in front of you it has renamed all the files right so by this way you can rename the files which is available in a folder you can rename multiple files 
at once in a few second only you can see here we have 13 files and it it just took around you know two three seconds only to complete that one so i hope you like that if so then please like this video and please subscribe this channel if you have not subscribed yet and please subscribe my another channel blue prism rpa and pande 2.0 please support me there also thank you so much